Version 4.4 is coming to an end and 4.5 will go live on March 13th. Aside from the banners, there is not much to forward to in the next patch. However, we will see what we can get from 4.5, so grab your adventurer's handbook and get ready to count those primogems, because we're going to calculate all the ways you can rack up primogems in 4.5 update. Before starting, I would like to mention that this data is given by beta players, and I have also confirmed some things I could from the version 4.5 special program, so this data should be accurate. First things first, as soon as 4.5 is available, all players will receive 600 primogems via in-game mail as a compensation from Hoyaverse. And then what do we do? We do daily commissions, the update will last for 42 days, so players can earn up to 2520 primogems by doing daily commissions. Version 4.5 will celebrate a festival in Mondstadt, which will be our main event, and it's the only good thing about 4.5. Other than the main event, there will be three other mini-events, each rewarding us with 420 primogems. So the total number of primogems we can get from events is 2,260, including the main event. Kyderi is also going to release in 4.5, so you can complete her story quest to get 60 extra primogems. Version 4.5 will feature Chayori, Arataki Ito, Nuvalet, and Kazuha's banners. Four limited banners mean that there will be four test runs as well, so you can get 80 primogems from there. There's also this new Chronicle banner, which will feature three limited characters, Eula, Albino, and Klee, will also be available for test runs, so you can get 60 more primogems from test runs. The Spiral Abyss will reset three times during version 4.5 update, so if you're able to 36 star at each times, you can get up to 1800 primogems from there. By the way, how many stars did you get in the last month's Abyss? Let me know in the comments. Payment Shop will reset once during version 4.5 so you can get 5 Intertwine and 5 Acquaint Fates from the shop. And at last, we will get 3 Redeem Codes worth 300 Primogems for watching version 4.6 special program. Hoyoverse would also release some web events worth 200 to 300 Primos, so you can also do that for some extras. Remember, these are just estimates and the actual amounts may vary slightly. But the bottom line is 4.5 doesn't have anything special, and the number of primogems you can get from 4.5 will be far less than the current patch. Now after adding these numbers, we can get around 7,808 primogems and 5 intertwined fates, which is equal to 54 wishes only. That's way too low compared to the number of banners we will get in 4.5. 54 wishes for 7 limited character banners, it's crystal clear that Hoyoverse wants us to spend money.